In this podcast, I'm going to be going through how to make a really throaty style electro bass that eventually is going to sound like this. So let's create ourselves a new MIDI track. And select the ES1. There's very little you have to adjust within the S1 to get the basic sound that we need to start creating this bass sound. The first oscillator is right, but the second oscillator, just move it round and add a bit more drive in. The filter section is pretty much right, you just need to up the cut off a little bit. And that's pretty much all you need to do within the S1. The rest of it is all plugins that we'll have a look at in a sec. We can now come out of the ES1 and start having a look at the channel strip settings that we need to make that bass line just that bit beefier. Because at the moment, this is what we've got. It's getting there, but it just needs a few extra bits. First thing we're going to do is add some distortion. Uh, this is all down to personal taste now, so just play around with each of the plugins and see what you like. Again, so that's just made it that bit more crunchier and given it that bit more edge. The next thing I'm going to do is add Guitar Amp Pro and change a couple of the settings. Just go for one of the presets, to be honest, because they're all good enough. That's pretty much there now. So. The next things you could look into doing are EQ, compression and limiting because it's such a harsh bass sound, you want that punch to stay there, you don't want it to get lost in the mix.